What's up, Foundation Nation? Today we're back for episode two of Break 57. Let's get into it. 2024 is here and in full swing, and that means it's time for a New Year resolution check-in from our friends at Manscaped. Newsflash, it is never too late to up your grooming game to the next level, and you can do that with the brand new Lawnmower 5.0 Ultra. This groomer from Manscaped is perfect whether you're looking for a little trim or go all the way to that clean shaven, and you can join the over 10 million men worldwide who trust Manscaped by getting 20% off and free shipping with the code BOGEYBROS over at manscaped.com. Now, the early voting count is showing that the MVP of 2024 is gonna be Manscaped's Lawnmower more 5.0 ultra this thing comes with two blades first it has a standard one for taking a little off the top and second it has a foil blade for that clean shaven look both equipped with their skin safe technology and did we mention it's waterproof because a trim in the shower is the best way to start the day let's face it resolutions may come and go but a well-groomed you is here to stay thanks to manscaped and you can head over to manscaped.com and get 20 percent off and free shipping with code bogey bros that's one word Bogey Bros get you 20% off and free shipping at manscaped.com. Thanks again for their support throughout all these years. Support them and support us. Let's get into the video. Here for uh, attempt number two, still early in the year. Quite a nice day, a little bit warmer today. I think, I don't remember what it was like last time. It was a long time ago, it feels like. <laughs> it does feel like it was a really it long does. time ago. I mean, it's a month apart. Cause yeah, I mean, by the time you're watching this video, I may have a new kid, like, so my perspective might change for next month's. Uh, attempt. But <laughs> I learned a lot last attempt. I learned a lot. Uh, mostly learned that, that I would feel hopelessness in this series because I didn't think I was going to feel hopelessness and I felt it hard. But I think I have to just, I think what I learned the most is I can't come out here and like the last one was like a baseline, whatever. But I can't come out here and think that anything less than my best game is going to succeed. So I have to be very focused. I have to focus on every single shot because it's, I now know that it will legitimately take a perfect round for me to do this. So I gotta lock in, I gotta lock in. So today, high focus, high focus, high attitude. We gotta okay. keep them here. Ask me where they are a few, like every once in a while, ask me, where's your attitude and where's your focus? Other way around, where's your <laughs> focus and where's your attitude? Ask me and I'll tell you where my levels okay, are. Okay, and you if, you're feel, high. if you're feeling kind of low, I'm just gonna yell, hey Trevor, get high. Yeah. Okay. That's what I need. All right, hole one. Always a little bit intimidating. I quite like this hole, but it is intimidating because you're going over water. If you shank your shot, like you could go out of bounds right away. Um, I'm gonna go putter, I'm gonna throw the pace here because I went mid last time. The mid range, especially when you got adrenaline doing these kind of videos, like you're a little nervous. The mid range is gonna get me long in the basket. I don't want that putt. I'd almost rather be short in the ditch. In fact, I would. So we're gonna go putter. That's turned over. That was a nice line. Fine. Yeah. yeah, probably eh, might have a little run at it, but there's a little bit of headwind today and that putter isn't quite stable enough for that shot. How are you feeling on the big trev today, Big Hunt? I feel good. I'll let you know how I feel after this putt more. Okay. But the drive was okay. I wouldn't if I were you. Because remember, if we three every hole, we win by three. Yeah, I don't even think I'm going to run this. No, three every hole, win by three? Wow. Quite the attitude. A lot of threes there, you know? <laughs> Lucky number, too. I'm wearing the Bogey Bros Dry Fit, which you can purchase at foundationdisc.com. Connor, why don't you show them the shirt you're wearing today? Ah! I'm wearing the Who's Got It, Cons Caught it. You got, got it. it, you have to, if you're gonna say it. Cons say Caught it. it. I'm wearing the Who's Got It, Cons Got It, which you can also get from foundationdisc.com, but today, Trev's got it. Get blocked! <laughs> I gotta be honest with you, this isn't even the most straightforward layup, because I gotta make sure I don't let it slide into that ditch. That was. <laughs> that would really suck, Trev. But I am gonna lay it up. Yep. Now you just got a three, and by Hunter's calculations, that means you're winning by three right now. I am yes. currently in the win. All right, hole two. Had a bit of trouble on hole two last time. Got to get the drive in play. Got to keep it, like, not left. Left sucks. You got it? Left, left sucks. Left sucks. We witnessed it last time. Yeah. It sucked. I want something that flips up a little bit. Ain't something like that. I think I'm going to go with the grace. Ooh. Yeah, it's quite nice. Now that is a wise man. Don't hit that thing. Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay. That is like one of the most <laughs> unlucky, th I mean, the, the branch was there. I'm not gonna say it was unlucky, it was unfortunate. <laughs> is there a difference? <laughs> yes, because it wasn't technically unlucky, it just stinks that it happened. Is that what fortune is? Maybe. Because maybe. I mean, I picked that little branchy out. If it missed that, I was gonna hide right back to the fairway. I, I will say, as long as I didn't go in those trees, I'm probably still at a better spot than being up the hill further and left, but that Trim. just, that was a bummer. Take that, Yuli. He just got ripped by Trevor's far. overhand. Ah. Did it go long? Yeah, into the woods. There's a little gap. There's a little gap there! Where's Brody? <laughs> yeah, I didn't realize he was here. <laughs> Dark horse, yes! Yeah. 
He is loud. Huh? <laughs> I think it's a backhand, like kind of flex shot with a Toro. Yeah. Get down. Get down. Great shot. Great shot, Trevor. That was pretty good. I even did the old hit your chest on the pull through. <laughs> nice. Stay high. Heck yeah. Stay high. Do you see that thing try to get out of there? I did. It tried to. Not so no, no, fast. No, no, no. Just Ew. give myself credit when what I What is that? <laughs> did Brody bring a cat with him? Did y'all's dads have a friend named Cal? No. Cal? My dad had a friend named Cal. No. Got a cousin. Got a cousin named Dylan. Um. All right. <laughs> hole three. This is a tough hole, guys. And I'm last time I did pretty good, so I'm hoping I do pretty good again. I'm going with the Supra, eyes are flat. I, don't I mean... hope it's a Supra good shot. Take <laughs> on for your encouragement, sir. <laughs> First gap hit. Miss that. Tree. Missed that. Ooh. Ooh. Going the oh my gosh. Oh, still Ooh. fantastic shot. Fantastic. Excellent. Shot. Luck's on our side. You need that out here. You do. Need you do. Pin high. Good shot. Good shot, Trev. Uh, Good shot, Trev. I'm going to play the Heiser like stall putt. I put that way too wide to start with. Another three. Another three. That's fine. Really tough hole here. 395 feet. Very small gap. Creek plays casual. Got to push it out there. Got to try and get through these gaps. Hope we can keep the gap heading alive. Going Raider, Heiser, Flip. You threw a pretty decent shot on this hole last time. Yes, Trevor. That's so good. That's great. Oh. Still fine. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. 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 Pretty, pretty similar to last time. Where That's awesome. Glitter. Probably a three, but hey, great score on this hole. Get left. Oh. I would have made that putt. <laughs> <laughs> Hole five, very tricky shot. Got to get it through the gap and then work it just a little right because the creek is OB on this one. Last time I threw a really good shot, it's just very hard to get a disc to like get right, but not like turn into the creek. So I ripped it over. That's gonna be just fine. Gonna get lucky though. Please get lucky. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Anyway. It's the first time I've committed to a hyzer flip and had my main mistake, which is where I just hold on to it too long, but we got lucky. Focus high. Attitude high. Hi, focus. Great job, yeah. Trevor. That was like a, that was a tough, testy shot right there. It was, I was. I found so much success doing, like pulling down my Anheuser putts like this. Cause you don't, you don't stay there. Like if your arm's gonna correct a little bit, but if I go down normal and try to switch mid throw, never no, works. No. You got, mm. I gotta start with the over exaggeration. I love that. Steering wheel. Oh my gosh, and Lance Whoop. is a genius. Just Nate Dossett, baby, just. Ah! Uh, hole six now, kind of a tough one. Well, it's only really as tough as you make it. Cause the shot itself, it just goes down this hallway and fades a little right into a ditch. So if you have the right shot, I like the forehand just cause I feel like it's less prone to getting that disaster kick left. Going hyzer flip forehand with the stalker. Difficult shot. I can do it though. I'm capable of it. Yes. A little inside. I'm not gonna beat that green. That's fine though. Yeah. Far. Little up and down that I gotta execute here. A little inside. That's fine. Yeah. Yes, Trevor. Importante. Moy, some have even said. Moy importante. <laughs> do what we gotta do. The little things, the little things. You gotta do little things. It's a forehand that I can't technically reach, but I need to throw the forehand because it's the one that gets me the safest and makes me feel the safest. I like that, Trevor. I like whenever you feel safe. I'm actually gonna go Raider. I've been putting a little bit of oomph into the forehand. After seeing you rob the C forehand a Raider, I think that's what the only forehand disc anyone should use. <laughs> wow, Trevor. Forehand, it's short, but, it flip up enough, but it's yeah. gonna be just fine I'm gonna there. take that every time. That's just we'll what we're getting today. Down. We're getting just a bunch of not perfect, but I'll take it every time. Oh, I missed the gap. <sighs> Got the first lucky gap, missed the second one. I mean, it's a four from there. It is what it is. This is a uh, pretty easy hole. You just gotta throw it up there and get a little left it's in the short pin. Tough birdie. A lot of I mean, I said this last time, but here's the theme out here. Everything's a tough birdie. Mm -hmm. And yeah. it's already also it's like a big bird. It's a tough birdie, a tricky par, and an easy bogey. That had some that had some significance behind it. Trevor's name backwards. I'm kind of dealing right now, but the course is not letting me have blackjack. Uh, <laughs> no, you're forgetting about the luck you've had, Trevor. Don't deal the course a bad hand. You're right. You've had two. Your the course. course You've got a ace face up and probably a king coming behind. So you're good. You're going to double up. Double up. Uh, you lost it all. As I'm walking up here, I'm realizing this hole is really hard to birdie. Like you could get lucky there, but you really got to push into this right gap and then dump left and you maybe get a downhill 25 footer. Like this is a tough hole. 
Oh, I went inside. Go in. In the bucket. Woo! Oh. <laughs> Oh. Wow. Now it's about 80 feet down the hill, but that was exciting. We had yeah. a moment. There was a second there where I was like, this course loves this guy. Uh, I was thinking the same thing. Ooh. Oh, don't you dare do disc. it. Thank you. Ooh. Sorry. Sorry. Lost my cool for a second. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I could have handled what Hunter was going to say next if it kept rolling. <laughs> <laughs> nice, Trev. That's fine. You know. Another hard hole couldn't be. Oh, but it is. Another job for the grace. This is a long par three. It's, an, it's, it's another hole. Back to back to back holes where birdie is almost impossible. Par is difficult. I, I like you with that disc, Trevor. Got to grind with it. It's working. It's working, yeah. Uh, uh, would you mind calling that cotton candy? It's not quite, though. It's kind of purpley and like But it's like teal purple and blue cotton candy. Fine. Never mind. Don't call it anything. Yeah. Nope. No, I'm, yeah. Nope. It's too late. You can't go back on what you said now. I don't want to. Nope. You can't, Trevor. You can't try to compliment me now. Yeah, that's funny. Thanks. See, I complimented you. Ah! Oh, no! Oof. I finally got burnt. Took a few holes. It's okay. Not, We're fine. We still make four. Fine. We scrambled, take a three. I don't know about that. Scramble up four. a three. I hit too many gaps in a row. That one just didn't quite commit all the way. I got a little bit of the peripheral vision curse. Oh, saw that, saw no. Saw that tree like 10 feet away from me, and I got a little scared. Oh, yeah, put those blinders on you. Just sit that down over there. Should, a little bit right, but should be able to get up and down from there for both. I hit it. Right, Great shot, Trevor. There you go, and that's how you take a four. Alrighty, on to the back nine. We're three over right now. We're hanging around. I can't remember where I was last time, but I feel like I played better on the front this time. Starting off with hole 10 here, 300 foot. Uh, ends on kind of an island. It's not OB though. And this is a gettable, gettable hole. I'm going rock. That looks good. That looks great. Get down. That, oh. I think that was going too far. It might have been. I just can't believe that, man. Like, how did I get to that tree so quick? Do it. Oh, Trevor. Great shot. Wow, Trevor. 330. Very tough to birdie. That far? That's crazy. It's making my stomach hurty. Oh. Yeah, it's not looking so purdy. Oh. Trevor, where are you at right now? Where am I at? And what? Sense. You still... Oh, I'm, I'm here. I'm good. Still high? Good attitude. Yeah, playing good. playing solid golf today. Good. Yeah, this is kind of where it can end for me. This is usually where I start throwing a little fit. Don't throw a fit. <laughs> Might throw a little fit. Don't mistreat the course, Trevor. I yeah. think I go. Do you like stalker here? Just punch it. I think you should probably throw it. Do you want I still think it's a mid. You think everything's mid. But I, I am throwing kind of far today, so I'll go Supra. Nah. Mm, or over there. Just straight back. Okay. That's all right. That's fine. That's fine. Pull it right. I think also need to go state more stable because I'm going so low on that shot, but we're alive. So we're alive. We're alive. Going so low. That was not perfect. Check up. That's fine. Yeah. Yeah. Nice, Trev. Opportunity is coming knocking. Hello, opportunity. Hole 12. It's par four. Got to get down to the corner and throw an up shot and make birdie. There's OB on this hole. There's trouble. There is trouble. With a capital T. Got to get this shot in play. Last time I left it left. That was stupid. Going with the rock. This one's more stable. A little bit of headwind. Just got to throw it straight. Too much headwind. Come on. Kick out. Too much headwind for that angle. Dang, that went really, really far in there. Yeah, but so it works towards the corner. So like, as long as I can punch out, then in theory, I could punch to a place where I can get up and down. I underestimated the headwind a little bit and I just gave it way too much ante, but that is a difficult shot because like then it requires me to throw that disc with hyzer and mm -hmm. I, I don't know if I'm built for that. Bingo. Yeah, great shot. Yeah, wow, Trevor. Trevor. You dirty biscuit. Gotta go. No, that's fine. That was still really I nice. That was like 50 player. short. It was a great shot. Good line though. though. It was, was great. Fantastic. Little deceptive, fantastic line. <laughs> Tempted it, you know. That's you tempted it. It's tempted. I was tempted. I was tempted to take my shirt off and celebrate, but you missed. Yes, Trav. Yes, important. Trav. The story of the day so far is you got to score. Hole 13 here. It's around 350, par three, tough shot. It's a shot that you got to throw a pretty quick hyzer flip here, really quick. Honey, I don't think I have another disc that'll flip as much as I need this to. Honey, I don't think I have another disc that'll flip as much as I need exactly it to. Exactly right, big con. I think I just need more highs wrong. Yeah. I think it just, I kind of popped out of it a little bit because mm -hmm. genuinely like my Raider just won't flip over that I think much. that was the right disc. Yeah. yeah. yeah that's a tough one. 
Yeah, good shot. The scrambling is on today, and it was not on last time. Like the short game is here, and it's it's proving to be pivotal. Cool frisbee, another Trev. Another par, another par. I want a birdie. You know how I feel about this one. It's a very long spider tree. tree. Oh, the spider tree. That's interesting. They put it in oh. front of the spider tree. Yeah, I wonder if the. I wonder. That's, that's just 400. Bunch of cowards. <laughs> yeah. I would agree. Hashtag put it back in the spider tree. Hashtag grace. Like Have grace for them. Oh, Trevor. Uh, Come on. Get off of it, you jerk. Uh, that was, like that was pretty good. Bumpers up. It's like a good shot, and it's like 100 short. Wow. Yeah. Wow, Trevor. That was gorgeous. Up and down, up and down. Tough hole. This is the one I had a meltdown. No, it isn't. No, no it's not. Next one. It's the next one. Yeah, I threw Stalker last time. I'm probably I'm gonna rip into this T bird. I'm gonna try yeah. and miss a little more left. I don't want to flip it over. Huh. Yes. It needs to get left though. Yeah, I think it was too straight. So many almost hey. shots today. Deep in the so a whole lot of that today. This is the hole I threw a fit on last time. And rightfully so I threw a fit. I will say at least the good news of this tee shot is I feel like once you get through the initial gap, which is really small, you're you're in business. So we're gonna stalk her and just try and hit the gap. No. Oh, oh okay. yeah, that'll be fine. I think I got that kick last time too. I think it was the second shot. That's the dog. And the dog got a haircut. Oh, he does look, hey, puppy. He looks nice as well. Look how happy he is. Wow, he does look so he happy. Looks so, like he got. A, he is a fresh bat. I saw him on the way in, and I just Hi. thought to myself, Hi. I can't be that dog. That dog is like a shaggy dog. Oh, no, him's a good, oh, he's a good boy. Oh, there's a good boy. Kind of looks oh, like a mastiff. I can see that. Should we name him? Let's name him Birdie. You know, whatever score I take on this hole is his name. No. Okay. Can you take a bogey? I like bogey as a dog. Yeah. Game. That's a really nice throw, Trevor. That was a really a nice throw, Trevor. Shot, guys. All right, I just lay that up. We got a birdie putt. Big uh, Trev with the bird. Put that one in the good column. Okay, well, the dog's name is now Birdie. Come here, Birdie. birdie. Oh, he's running so fast, he's recognizing his name. He must speak French. A birdie. Uh, all right, hey, we got a birdie. You know, let's close out strong at this point. Let's go birdie, birdie, birdie to end. Yes. Can't do that, but I could go ace birdie. Why? You went birdie, then you just go birdie. Oh, birdie. oh, oh, oh I understand. Hole oh, 17. No. Speaking of birdie, he's right in the danger zone. Birdie, you move. That's a like bad if I boy. Hit that dog, it would be a birdie out of circle one. Birdie out of circle one. All right, he's moving. He's moving. Here we go warbird flex shot. Got over last time. Oh, Trevor. Oh, that's gonna be great. I, I think you're across. I think, I think you're I think good, yeah. I think you have like 20 footer. We need to train Birdie better. He should be going and sitting next to the disc right now. You know where it's at. <laughs> <laughs> he also didn't really seem to have a desire to chase your frisbee. He's dancing. He's doing the Birdie dance. Trevor, he's calling <laughs> in. Yeah. Wow. Not a good putt. <laughs> I don't want to go in if it wasn't for the Birdie dance. Last hole. Hey, it's been a pretty good round. I'm only two over right now, so can't do it mathematically, but it's been a good day. Just want to finish strong here. Got to clear the water. 435. Tough shot. Probably have to go grace again, right? Yeah. It's kind of just been the disc today. Yeah. Your teeth are like sparkling too. Look at those things. You got Trevor? The amount of drool that just came out of this dog's mouth and arm. Dude, that got really stable. Surprise. <sighs> right, Hopping out for par. Good day of work. You know, good, good round in month two. What do you think, Birdie? Almost a little too good. He's too score. Uh, you see what I'm saying? You see the <laughs> amount of slobber just came out? Bro, watch where you're slinging that stuff. Just, he just jumped in the water <laughs> and has just gone crazy. He's got the zoomies. <laughs> He's got jump, jumped all over Trevor. Oh. Luckily, he just loves Trevor. <laughs> I'm going to go with the rare driver jump putt because the ceiling is low, but I want to jump putt it. There was an argument in our Discord, Trev, that drivers, like in this situation, when you're powered way down, will not go farther. What's your take on that? Thinner disc cut through the wind quicker. And also, they, they slide more as well. I would tend to agree. Yeah. I don't know what your argument could be. It wasn't that. my argument. Yeah. They, they were just coming they after They literally. Our, they were coming after our boy Nate because he was saying he this, likes to disc up to a faster driver point, to throw it slower and still have it get distance. This point goes through wind better than this blunt edge. Now, would a destroyer on like a. I think it's probably minimal, but like. Foot, a 200 foot power. Would a 12 speed go farther than a six speed? On the, could you jump put a destroyer farther than a T-bird? So let's just go either. distance. Let's just, we're, in, we're in a wide open field now. All these trees, gone, log, WR yeah. Jackson. If I just threw my best jump putt with both, yeah. destroyer's destroyer gonna go further. 
Yeah, I think so. Detroit fighter? I think so. I would agree. Yeah, I that was just the argument. Should have went 12 speed. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think the putter would have skipped like that. No, it wouldn't. Try the same thing with the putter. Uh -huh. Yeah. You know what? Let's try right you now. Know, I putter. could do it with the putter, too. I'm try trying to make it easier on myself. Yeah, that was nowhere near as far. Shoot! Yeah. Mitt <laughs> busted! <laughs> there you have it. King. There we have it. Uh, final score 59. 59. Plus 259. That's pretty Only dope. Three, off. three strokes off, and there were definitely three strokes to be had. It's a, it's a weird feeling when you get this close. I do feel like the good news is, I feel like I, like on a day like this where things are clicking, three more strokes could have gone my way. Um, there's probably one putt in particular, the birdie putt early I could have made, and um, took three consecutive bogeys at one point. So I, I definitely can do it. I need more birdies. That's just how it's gonna be. But I'm happy with what I played. It's a weird round because like that was so close to doing it, but I just wasn't quite in it. Uh, late in the round just because of the strokes I had accumulated. The front nine is going to be the key, similar to New London. You got to hang around the front and then you got to attack the back. But I feel good about that. I mean, it's weird in months two to get that close because now it's like I have an expectation. So I feel like the next few months could be very difficult. But yeah, so the next few months are going to be challenging to like continue to play well because now if I if I shoot like four strokes worse than that, I'm going to feel pretty gross. I don't know. Put down in the comments below how long do you think it's going to take me to break it? Do you think I'm good to go next next month I'm going to do it? Or is this going to be like, was that my best golf and am I toast? Could be either thing. Hunter, what do you think? I like May. May. I like May. I think next month's going to be your worst month. Simply kid factor. It'll be out of practice a little bit. No, You're going to come back that. rusty. Putt's going to be a little off. You're going to get frustrated early. Yeah. April is when things are going to get back to this point. You're going to yeah. put some stuff back there and be like, oh, it is possible. Okay. May, you're going to do it. All right. That's what, that's my prediction. We'll have to see. Comment down below what you think. Buy grip lock tats. See you next time.